shot here. And it's not because he hasn't been producing. Boy, he set up Garrett Klotz last night. And now we got a mix up as that's Bembridge that's trying to grab Klotz. And Klotz is, oh, oh he just pounded McKenzie. And McKenzie went down. Now Barube is trying to get in the middle of it. And coming over to grab him. McKenzie's opened up. He opened him up good with that uppercut. And that was because Klotz was mad. He had three guys from Denver trying to hit him. And it started all with McKenzie. And McKenzie paid the price for that. You don't get started on Klotz if you're not going to stand up to him. I thought we were going to have a line brawl there. But it ended up getting broken up pretty quick. Well, maybe he mentioned something about that video. Yeah. Could have been, but the thing is, you know, you had three Denver cutthroats. All of them, you know, I guess McKenzie comes in, takes a cheap shot at, at uh, Klotz, and then two other guys uh, try to come to his rescue in a three-on-one situation. doesn't matter, Klotz, if, if you got him fired up, he's going to come right through you, which is what he did. He dropped the gloves, and he opened up McKenzie's. You see the blood there on the ice. And that was a beauty uppercut that he had. He just grabbed him by the jersey, pulled him in, and drilled him with an uppercut. McKenzie dropped like a sack of flour here's the play here mckenzie takes a shot right in the mouth and then he's got beverage trying to protect him and you got schwab trying to protect mckenzie mckenzie wants nothing of it but klotzy was not going to get stopped he went right through it as of, as we've been seeing with denver the sticks come up every time there's a shot a cross check right in the jaw that's what started the whole thing off and you remember that was the case last night too as McMillan got one right in front of the net. Look at Martinson and Matt Pachuk. They're hot right now. And again, it's the same MO from this Denver Cutthroat team. The sticks come up every time. When you have teams that are repetitively doing this, you've got to call it. You've got to stand by. Uh, you got to call it smart. And you got to stand by your uh, precedents in the league by handing out suspensions. And this is a time that could actually uh, hurt Denver as we go into postseason. If there is a suspension handed out, they could be without McKenzie for a couple games here.